Hi everyone, uh, this is Lakshman. In this video, I am going to talk about the Java coding standards in Java programming language, or we can also call this one Java naming convention. Naming convention or Java coding standards. Okay. So, the what are the Java naming conventions and uh, or Java coding standards must follow as a Java developer? We will see all these things in this video. So, these naming conventions are suggested by several Java communities such as Sun Microsystem and Netscape. All the classes interface packages methods and fields of java programming language are given according to the java naming convention if we fail to follow these conventions it may generate confusion so whenever you try to learn new language one of the first thing you should determine what coding standards and guidelines for that language exist so let us see what are the benefits of code, uh, standard coding. Benefits of standard coding. It improves the readability. Improves the readability. What is the meaning of improves readability means? You make your code easier to read for yourself and other programmers okay and it allows easier development it allows easier development of automated tools to assist in the programming development in the programming development okay so these are the advantages or benefits of the standard coding the first one is it improves the readability that means everyone can easily read the program and other programmers also can easily understand the java coding okay now let us see the java coding standard guidelines the first one is coding standard for class. The class name must be the class name must be start with uppercase letters. Uppercase letter. Okay. The class name must be start with uppercase letter. Okay. The class name should be noun. The class name should be noun. If it contains multiple words, every inner word also should start with capital letters. So, for example, string. String is a class. So, the string, the, the class name must be, should be start with uppercase letter only. Okay. Suppose we take another one, null pointer. So, it contains multiple words, null pointer exception. Okay. So, in this uh, it is a multiple words so null pointer is one and exception is one so every uh, inner word should also start with the uppercase only okay suppose if you take another one employee is emp is so this is also one of the class so you should start with uh, if it contains multiple words then that class name 
inner words are must be upper case letters okay so this is the standard coding for classes okay now see coding standard for interface okay interface also follows just like class guidelines only interface name should be adjective name should be should be adjective okay so this is also just like class guidelines only so the interface name should start with the upper case letter okay so if it contains multiple words every word every inner word also should start with the capital letter let us see some example clonable this is one of the interface and runnable okay suppose if it contains multiple words like uh, runnable demo okay so every inner word if it contains multiple words every inner word should start with the uh, upper case it's just like class guidelines it, uh, it's just like a class guidelines only okay next we will see coding standard for methods okay so every method should start with the lower case should start with the lower case letter every method should start with the lower case letter if it contains the multiple words then the inner word should be upper case only if it contains the multiple words the inner word should start with the upper case letter only okay uh, this convention is also called as kml case convention uh, for example if we take uh, two string so this is one of the method see here the method should start with the lower case and the inner word should start with the upper case you can also call this this type of convention is camel case convention uh, one more example get name okay and another one get message okay show display all these are all these are methods okay every method should start with uh, small letters only okay next we will discuss coding standards for variable okay the variable starts with uh, noun and every inner word should start with uh, upper case this uh, that means uh, this is also kml convention only suppose uh, example student okay so every uh, variable should start with lower case only if it contains multiple words then the inner word should be should start with upper case this naming convention also just like a kml convention uh, suppose one more uh, variable total number okay okay uh, next uh, employee salary okay like this next uh, coding standards for constants so it contains only upper case letters and separated with the underscores the constants are always a uh, you need to define with the upper case letter only okay uh, for example max size underscore size okay min size underscore size 
college name okay these are all constants variables okay max priority so these are the examples for constants okay now we'll see uh, source file organization the entire java program how the uh, naming convention should follow source file source file organization okay so a java source file shall contain a single public class or interface a public class should be the first class or interface declaration in the file so the order will be the source file organization order will be like this the first one is package declaration next is import declaration next is class comments class comments including uh, description description other other and version okay the next one is one or more class or interface interface declaration starting with a public class and a interface declaration so these are the uh, source file organization you should follow this order first one is a package declaration package declaration import declaration class com comments including including description or the version one or more class or interface declaration okay so this is the java naming convention or java coding standards every java programmer or developer should follow okay so to improve the readability okay so if you like our videos so please subscribe to our youtube channel and share to your friends and also likes our videos so thank you for watching bye bye